Gavin's back and he's ready to rush down these walls of this siege, but is something not missing? Where did his rocket launcher go? Does he not need it to bring down these gates? Well, actually, no. All right, man, we're in a siege. We got our rocket launcher. We're gonna blow this gate right open and rush inside and kill every single person inside. Bam! Wait, what? You're joking me. What? 40, 50, 58 damage? What the hell is this? I'm just as shocked as you upon realizing that in fact a rocket launcher cannot bring down the main gates of a castle. But something else can. Uh, can we see it? It's in his hand and I can't see anything. Uh, hold on. No. Anyway, it's a grenade. Can the grenades do it? It's explosives. That's more like it. I see explosive power smashing down these front gates here. Modern technology, ladies and gentlemen. Explosive grenades just barreling down this gate, doing massive amounts of damage. We've already used half of them. The gate's still not down. It's actually a lot of damage. A lot of damage. And the gate's still standing. My goodness, these old timey gates are powerful. Do we, are we even going to have any grenades left? We got through. We are through the front. We are actually... We broke right through. Guys, it's time. The front is gone. Grenades, ladies and gentlemen. Explosives. They are clearing the way. A bombastic modern weaponry. And now it's time to blow the rest of them down with a shotgun. A bit sad we couldn't blow it all up with a rocket launcher, though. And a bit sad that guy ran right into me. But oh my goodness, here comes the rest of them. Everybody is desperate to get in here. And not have to go up on any siege troops. You know what? I can, I can relate to that. In fact, we can also just fire... Can we shoot this guy? No, we can't re he we can't hit that. But we can't even go in there in the middle, because we'll just end up shooting our own guy. So we'll stand here where we cannot actually be shot by the enemy siege weapon rear. And uh well that's just a standing shield. What am I doing? Gavin will freely fire at the remaining enemies. That could be seen out here. Which is there's still plenty of them. There's enemies everywhere. And we have a siege tower going up over there. Lovely. Now we can have some more people coming in. Oh, those those guys. Um, ouch. I said ouch. Wait, do we not have another grenade? We used all the grenades to get in. Fair enough. Oh, they're powerful. Oh, we've got people coming up the ladders. Dude, get out of the way, man. Don't get shot. Sometimes I just think the NPCs want to die. Oh, and look. They just abandoned the... Uh, yeah. Blowing ram, of course they did. Uh, guys, go in. There's rocks being thrown from up here. Rocks still hurt. A tiny pea brain from human being. You know what? That seems to be very effective. How did the enemies defend the siege when you just blow open the gate with one man? Makes you wonder if Gavin couldn't solo an entire castle with these explosives. I'm not sure he really has enough bullets for that with his shotgun. And needing that many grenades for it. I mean, you didn't notice he had 20, all 20 to get in. Which is kind of exactly the amount he needed in the end. 68 kills. And so, the castle was taken. Amicon Castle has been besieged successfully. In great big part thanks to Gavin. Gavin the glorious gunman with his grenades requires 50 throwing. I didn't even realize Gavin had that. Who knew? Anyway, those grenades are special siege grenades. Naturally, for a of the Calradian Empire declares war on the Goldie. What? That must be because they're declaring war with the Palician. It's not just, come on, I'm their soldier. Just say Palician. Anyway, those grenades are only for sieges, because they are siege equipment, rare, powerful, and not the kind of weaponry that Gavin really appreciates to use the most. He, he loves triggers. He loves big, heavy, boom-boom monstrosities. They make him happy. 
so he will only use them when they're needed. Apparently the castle we had just conquered was getting besieged and now it isn't. I know the Vargia Kingdom is declaring war on the Goldie. My goodness. Seems like Felician is getting loads of enemies right now. Absolutely madness. All right. And we asked in the previous adventure of Gavin if he should get a new helmet. And most people said that he should. So indeed, Gavin is going to get rid of his trusty helmet. Well, get rid of it. He's going to replace it whilst he's in this army, unless it gets removed and dies, and then he'll lose everything. And then he'll have to go back to his old helmet. But until then, he is going to equip himself with a more formidable helmet. One that hopefully looks kind of similar in shape and size. This one kind of looks similar in the shape. Not entirely, but it is the same sort of covering, and it's also got mail, it kind of fits the aesthetic. And his previous helmet is not missing. It will return. We'll, we'll wear it as a civilian attire, you know? Still, it's basically civilian attire. It's what he's always worn his whole life. He was probably born with that helmet. Anyway, what are we doing? All right, besieging a castle. Oh dear, we are... Uh, an army may be coming to stop us. Uh, yes, it is. Oh dear. Gavin could defect to the other side, but he will never do that. He is a nationalistic man. Hey, Blythe's even in this army. I didn't even realize she could do that. And some lovely lady here. And note, seems like there's a lot of people here that we could appreciate. And as such, we cannot be defeated. Oh God, the plan is to create a defensive ring around the archers. Uh, no, I will actually be the commander of the infantry then. Okay, no, that's fine. Infantry forward! I am forming. Okay, hold on. Circle. Oh, oh, what's going on here? So apparently I forgot to press record again after the little issue there, or I misclicked. Ah, uh, but yeah, no, it didn't, didn't help. I decided to go away from the circling around the archers plan, but the archers still walked right inside the clump of infantry, did nothing, and uh, as you can see, it didn't go so well. Gavin killed 117 people, but really it wasn't. It, it, it was over quick, he didn't miss much. It was, um, fairly sad. Now it seems Garios of the Western Empire has stripped, he has simply stripped Gavin of his ability to bring glory to his country. This is not okay. Hategia Castle is getting taken. Rote is maybe getting taken. He needs to find a new lord to join ASAP. He needs to bribe him his way into Carthage. What? Any of these people have anything going on? Can I see if they have anything going on? So the only one who's being registered in here is Beringer. He's 16. There's no way he's got any troops. Oh, this is not... Oh, wait. He has troops. All right. You know what? Never right. mind then. I don't care who you are. I am here to give you a joke that you liked. Very and then well. I'm here to serve what in you your warband as a soldier. And then you pause. We're tier 7. Good. Let us get the new equipment again. Right. He's back to where he was. Now let's see what this Beringer fellow is going to do. Defend... A, no, he's, is he going to see somewhere? I don't think so. That must be where... Oh. Oh, right. There are multiple factions that are against. What are you doing in Hotegia? It's been... It's been... Ravaged, man. We need to defend this place. Yeah, Churik. Get rid of that guy. Wait, what's going on? We can't do anything. No, we're not allowed to help. This man needs our help. Okay. At least this time, we can help. On the defensive, you say? Do you have anything other than archers? I don't think so. Well, we'll control them then. Archers! Move! Luckily, he must realize that actually Gavin is the man. Forward! Because he's letting Gavin control all his troops. I do really appreciate that, Berenger, whoever you are. I will have to visit your family to inform them that you are a smart man. 
Uh, we're not moving down there. Simply because we don't have time. Guys, could you stand still for a moment? So I don't have to, you know, shoot you. Okay, it's going alright. Uh, I just have these stupid horsemen. Nothing Gavin can't handle with his doomsday. Enemy! Yes, I know, that was just a horse. This can only have horses? I thought for sure I saw infantry. Oh, there we go, there's infantry. What is this? One guy's only got archers, the other guy's only got ar uh, cavalry, basically. I am very confused about these army compositions here. Skirmish? No, we're charging. There's not a lot of enemies left. So we're going to finish off the ones that are left. Only forward, it's Beringer. You're a bit late there, mate. But you know what? Let's just make you think you're still in control. Huh? Do you know what? Let's take care of the rest in good old style. Okay, I missed. Seems they don't really explode so much if you don't hit the right kind of thing. Come on, rocket launcher, do your best. Okay, well, it still it still killed some people. It tried. It tried. Oh, bam! There we go. We got him. Don't worry, Beringer. We Gavin got most of them himself. Shurig. Yeah. Okay, you can be our prisoner. Silly Willy. Oh dear. Apparently Gavin has served long enough to fulfill his enlistment. He can honorably retire and keep his gear, but he has need for talented soldiers. He'll offer us a bonus of if we really... Ooh. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna re-enlist. Gavin doesn't feel like he's ready to do any drastic nonsense. Let's see. How is he doing? He's clan tier one. Clan tier one, guys. That's... <laughs> That's not a lot. It's not a lot. There's a lot more glory he can be had by following other people's armies and beast moding with- Oh, Harold! No, go help Harold! You dingy dongy! Yes. Oh, good. Harold is back. And victory is back on the menu, boys. Our plan is to remain on the defensive. Really? You know what? Fine. Gavin's gonna be an archer then. He's gonna control the archers. This time, though, he has taken the rocket launcher and said, Hey, you know what? It's time for a break. Forward. Look Walk that way. way. Excellent. Because Gavin didn't get the siege down, so he still has some grenades left. Uh, I'm not sure why he's going to face tank all these guys just because he's trying to throw grenades in. No, but it does seem somewhat more effective. Then the rocket launcher. Hop! Okay, miss. Kill him! The grenade is doing jobs! It's not that long range, but holy moly does it do stuff. There we go. Woo! Wait. The archers are just here. Where's the rest of the army? I know we have a lot of men, but hopefully we get to use them. Okay, we think we have to back up with our archers here because I don't even know where the rest of the troops are. Ah! No! Leave Gavin alone! Back off! You're getting corralled into the wrong area! Gavin will save his soldiers with boom and bam! And don't miss, man. Ah. Oh. Gomez, shut up, yup. You don't know what you're saying. You are abandoning us by having all the garbage down here. Ah, oh, I guess that's the problem with having half of the troops being controlled by someone smart. The other half is still controlled by idiots, and so it's disjointed and silly. But at least the other guy is Gavin. And so the chance of success is tripled, if nothing else, if nothing more. If not quadrupled, in fact. If not infinitely increased, even if he's missing some of these shots. It's dark, okay. I think he killed something there. 
There we go. More killing. Uh, time to charge. I don't see too many enemies on the bar. It's time to go full force, men. Strike hard. Strike fast. And, uh... Pew, 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 pew. Wait, that's not right. Damn, he's just up. Is he running? They're fleeing. Oh, dear. Kevin was only allowed to kill 92 people before they started fleeing. How disrespectful. There's 82 of them left. Do you know what? Leave it to the others. No, wait. Wait in reserve. The same thing. Wait. More people are declaring war on the Palician. Holy moly. Why are they doing it? This is not what the Palician deserve. They deserve victory and winning and success. Well, I'm a bit sad. Uh, uh, I would ask Commander for leave, but then I have to re-equip all my equipment again when I go talk to Harold. And King Harold actually does want some funny business to do. Well, look. Gavin. Indeed, last I heard, Gavin wished to employ... No, Harold wished to employ Gavin as a nobleman of sorts, even though he can't really do anything with this slow clans here. Anyway... We can go to the tavern and participate in a tournament. What is in the tavern? Nobody. Apparently we have prisoners though that we will ransom for money. We can heal our wounds in the tavern. That is actually very good. Go back to armor camp though. We want to participate in the tournament. Gavin has heard much of these tournaments. Oh hey, Western Chainmail Hood. That's the thing he's wearing right now. Wonderful. He wants to bet all his money. Not that it's all his money, but it's a lot of money. And he's betting it because he wishes to be able to afford a proper dowry for a noble lady that he wishes to marry. Of course, he already has someone in his sights, but you never know. It could be someone else. Anyway, Gavin has heard from most that it is, it is an expensive endeavor. And so he will be ready. Oh! Ah! No! Ah, oh, the little scary person! Ifikala. Yeah, Gavin's not so used to these weak weapons and is not entirely sure how to handle it. He's used to his enemies falling with one blow. What is all this weaponry that doesn't even strike people down with one? It's a bit weird, isn't it? Ah, they fall down easily enough. And Gavin is, of course, very athletic from eating his meat and cheese. So... He's fast. Pierce? Sorry, Pierce, but uh, Gavin is here to stay. Gavin is here to win. Even without his guns, Gavin is a beast. Perhaps the guns you're holding are not the guns. The real guns. Um, you were the gun all along. All right. I feel like there's, I'm trying to make some kind of reference here and I'm failing very hard. Oh, I'm glad that uh, Gavin is Right, I think Gavin has simply um, gained so many athletic skills from so many kills that he is just absolutely... He is so fast! Holy crap, when he's not wielding a massive gun, his movement speed is insanity. And he's even... <laughs> the finals with the... I guess the Felician Infantry, what is this? This is basically... Nothing. He has just fought lords and ladies. Okay, this guy still hurts. I was not expecting such a nub character to give Gavin trouble, but he did. Here he is, the tournament winner, Gavin! Unfortunately not with his guns, but you know, it's just how it goes, I guess. Kind of sad. All right, well, Western Chainmail Hood, let's uh, stick it in here. All right, yeah, and we will... There we go. His helmet in his civilian attire. Lovely. Now it's waiting for Beringer here to heal up. And then it's out to do battle again. Oh dear. It looks like this Beringer fellow has gone awry of Garyos' army again. At least, well, we're skipping it. Potemus Castle has been lost. And perhaps other castles. Beringer's castle? Did that not used to be our castle? I feel like we're losing a lot of castles here, guys. Maybe don't... Wait. What? Huh? Wait, we're supposed to battle? 338 guys now, Beringo. What are we... Oh, the army just split up and now we're fighting all of them. 
I mean, not the Atmos being species. Guys, come on. What's going on here? I think he's only got archers again. Archers! Forward! Yeah, sure looks like it. At least he's got the right uh, thought about it with how he's going to angle them. Yeah, because we need to aim them in the direction or they will kill themselves. You know, a natural formation that keeps moving is a formation where people are not firing their weapons. Let's just get rid of these uh, cow, cow riders. Dude, stand still. Thank you. Oh, God. Oh, wait, we've got the grenades again. Where's the rocket launcher? We can't reach them from here. Never mind. The shotgun from an elevated position is a weapon of mass destruction. We will shotty potty totty fruity them in the face. If they cannot hit Gavin, then they get hit by Gavin. And so, do you know what? We're just gonna, gonna go to the side. They're actually firing a little bit at Gavin here, but if we go over here, maybe they won't. Maybe they will, maybe they won't. I don't know. We got rid of their leader, I think? No? We got rid of... No. Where's the leader? That's the leader, surely. Oh, the leader we shot there. There's his horse, at least. No, we got Milos. I don't think that was the leader. Actually, there's loads of leaders here, isn't there? I forgot this is an army. Oh, shit. These guys may be moving forward. Let's get rid of them. If we can stop these guys from doing anything, we have a chance. We have a chance of doing this, man. I think... Okay. Grenade! Grenade the horseman! We missed. Grenade the horseman! We missed. Okay, where's the rocket launcher? We're gr grenade! Okay, you know what? I don't actually... I wish we had the rocket launcher right now. Oh, I'm glad we've got the grenades! Let's blow them up! Blow them in the face! Oh my god. Okay, no, we need to get rid of these guys. So the feel of feel. Oh my god, this guy threw something at me. Get rid of them. Why are the enemies standing... Are we actually going to win this because the enemies are standing still like idiots? I get the feeling that we will. They are just not doing anything. I like it. Never mind, they're charging now. And there are so many men that we they may still win. That person was walking sideways. That's kind of funny. Maybe we are getting so much morale penalty on them that we can still win. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, this is all the lords. Okay, Baron is starting to love us because we're a beast. I, I appreciate that. But I think we are. We are a beast. Hey, guys, did you just skip Gavin? I think that was a mistake. Wait, did we make them run? Are they running? I feel like they're fleeing. You cannot flee the boom! Boom! Blow up! Okay, that's all we had there. That's all right. Wait, is it going to horse? Not anymore, there isn't. Charge! Charge! We, we've got them on the run! Ah, we're blowing them all up! They just stood still for long enough for us to kill every single person they've got with the shotgun. What kind of idiocy is this? It doesn't matter! That the Felician strategy is garbage. When the enemy you're facing strategy is even worse. And by strategy, I mean standing still and dying. What are these guys over here even doing? They, these guys are like running. These guys are running backwards. I don't know. I didn't want to see it though. So they're gone now. And now they fled. Holy shit. 192, baby. Gavin is soloing this entire army and increasing in plants here for doing it. <gasps> of course he is. He's a beast after all. Naturally, Gavin will once again be controlling. Archers, forward! The archers. The bread and butter of this army. Wait, are they, are they much closer this time? I get the feeling they're much closer. Anyway... For this battle, Gavin has his rocket launcher. There's not... Oh, they are a lot closer this time. Oh! Oh, no! Uh, I like that... We put the arm um, archer line forward. And... Beringer is leaving his infantry right here. 
It really screams of a man of strategic competence. And now I know, I know, I walked right forward with a, without the shotgun, you know. I went in with the slow rocket launcher. Whoop, 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 whoop. But still, um, Gavin absolutely annihilated. It's, it's, it's no doubt. Okay, apparently not even bearing her could ruin this one at this point. I still think that, uh, Gavin, de des Gavin deserves all the credit here. Nine people left. I have to leave it to the others. Gavin doesn't have the help for this. Did, did Gavin really get renowned three times? That's kind of insane. Uh, who is this? Some woman who doesn't... Could maybe be postponed to work for us? You know what? Uh, no. She's free to go. This person looks like exactly the same kind of guy, but uh, no. This one is worth money. This lady is... That's more like it. Come work for Gavin. This is another exile with equipment. Come work for Gavin. How, how many people do they have working for them? No, we don't want this one. You're free to go. Guess we'll just keep looking at them to make sure to you know this one is free to go. How many? I don't know how many people Gavin even wants to like hire here. I think he just wants Zoros the Bull. Uh, you're free to go, mate. We, we don't care about you. How many followers do they have on their side? Everybody that's a prisoner, we're going to take prisoner because that's money. Oh, the game crashed. Come on! Guess we couldn't recruit. I don't guess we couldn't recruit any of them anyway.